Hey, what is going on, guys? So, today we're just gonna go fishing. Got some live bait with me. We're at the good old bridge right there. Believe it or not, sometimes there's some big smallies that come through, like four to five pounders. But, uh, yeah, there's a lot of carp here, or there used to be at least. I don't know how fishing's been. It's my first time going out in like two weeks because fishing has really been boring. And if I only have like three hours to fish, I'm not gonna take that with the canoe because that's a waste of time. Because basically it takes an hour to prep the canoe and bring everything back out. So by the time you get out on the water, you only get like one or two hours to fish. And that's not really worth it. My kind of ideal fishing is like, you need at least six to 12 hours of fishing. And with that amount of time, you probably only catch a couple because that's what happens when you don't have sonar, you know? You know, lately I've been really tired. So yeah content sucks the content sucks because it's hard to be creative or make good content when fishing is boring you're just bored overall in general and just low energy and you know whatever you know it is what it is you know but uh yeah just going out here to fish just have some fun just chill you know because uh yeah i'm tired lately i don't even want to wake up to go fishing <laughs> i'm gonna be honest with you guys man the weather is kind of sucks and like the rain doesn't help with the fishing you know at all or anything you can't really do anything when the fishing sucks or it starts raining you know you know the only thing you can really do is drum fish or fish for sheep head or drum but like the fish sheep head or drum haven't really even come in the waters this year but i don't know at least I, at least i know what i know of. at least they're super hard to catch <laughs> Maybe I just like it fishing. Just kidding, I think it's just because I don't try enough hard enough. But I don't know, I'm like, our rivers just suck really. I'm just waiting for a Samson to be honest. Because uh, fishing has been really boring, you know. And when fishing is boring, I don't feel like coming out and like doing nothing. But uh, yeah, yeah, I'll show you guys how to go ahead and show you guys the minnows. So uh, these are just the uh, minnows and tadpoles that I caught uh, feeding my bass. But uh, my bass hasn't eat eaten them, so. Maybe I'll catch some minnows or San Francisco scene or something so it works. Alright guys, so for our first setup, we're just gonna use a sinker and a Yamagatsu hook, small one. Let's go ahead and get a minnow rigged up. Alright, instead of actually using our uh, you know uh, minnow, we'll go ahead and use this tadpole right here. I'll see if I can show you guys. I don't know if you guys can see that, but uh, it's a tadpole. I'll go ahead and show you guys what he right. Got him hooked. I'm hook him through the nose. So I just got him hooked like that. He's barely in through the nose, kind of like that. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna go. Hopefully, it works. I'm just gonna cast it out like this. Can't cast too far, otherwise, you can help sling them all. And uh, now I'm just gonna use a. Uh, Basically just a regular good old bobber and a, another Yamagatsu hook. Hook the minnow through the head. Where the mouth I should say really. So I just got him like that. I don't know man, let's see if we can get anything to bite. Yeah. 
on the pink cinco on the first cast saw my line moving i was like oh yeah got one but uh, yeah let's go ahead and get a release on this guy well that's a good sign to get it for, get on the first cast on the cinco oh whole oh, carp is here now now that i uh you know, I chummed the water with corn. That's a good thing. If nothing hits a tadpole or something in a, long, in a while, a little bit, probably go ahead and switch the corn with uh, a, uh, what's it called? The, egg, the sinker one. But uh, yeah, I should probably recast my minnow. Yeah, so I did cast off that tadpole, so now I got a middle on the uh, sinker. Oh, that was a terrible cast. Whatever. Alright, so I'm just going to go ahead and try this out. This square one thing, babe. Oh man, it smells so bad. It's like barf. It's like diarrhea. Ooh. I think I got something on the window. It's on my line shoot though. Oh yeah. Yeah, I think I got something. It's probably something. This thing is not gonna make it. It's so small. I feel bad. Why did you not move my rod? You could have survived. Okay. Alright guys, now let me know what's uh, here for minnows. You know, pick up this corn, see if we can catch like a 20 pound carp or something. Place like another, I don't know, let's say 30 minutes or something. Then why are they looking at me? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna give this place another 30 more 30 minutes, something like that. And then, uh, hit up the pier or something. Because, uh, getting bored of this place already. We got ourselves a carp. Oh, it's a runner. Holy crud. Might be a big boy. That's what it is. Holy crud. 
Oh yeah, that's a runner compared to the ones, the other ones I was catching. Oh dang, yeah. <laughs> that's a runner, dude. This is a big one. Holy crud! As just as I was trying to break up my, my ah. Uh, I was trying to pick up my drop shot. Oh yeah, we got ourselves a big boy. We gave up already though. Oh no, no point there. Yeah, I think there's some structure. They can go under the bridge or something like that. So you don't want to let them go under there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> I got one of the big ones dude. I got one of the big ones. Explains why I was fighting so hard and running. Oh yeah, I got one of the big ones. This is like a 20 pounder. Holy crap. Oh yeah. This is what I was talking about. I don't know if it will even fit in my net. Hopefully it just gives up and lets me net him. Oh, don't go under there. Oh, steel peeling drag. Yeah, it's gonna take a while to get this guy in. Oh, hopefully there's someone to help me. It'd be so much easier to net this. This might be a buffalo, I think. It looks a little different. Jeez, that's a heavy carp. Oh, dang, that's a big one, dude. Holy crud. Oh, dang. Now, that's the biggest carp I've ever caught in my life. You are so heavy, get off my hook, hook rod. Oh, right, right on this. On the, uh. Oh, yep, right out. Didn't even bend the hook either, that's good. Light drag, man. <laughs> Should give, give my, uh. My. Dang. I weigh this guy. Probably above 20 something pounds. Hopefully, it lets me kill him. Holy crud! Bro, this thing's so heavy I can barely lift him. Bro, this thing's so heavy I can barely lift him. It's because his gill plate is small. It's hard to hold him correctly. Holy crud. If you had a gill plate like salmon, it'd be easy to hold him. But, oh. oh, shoot! Dang. No. Don't do that to my rock plate. Holy crud. I don't know guys. I can't really hold this fish through. Oh yeah, it has gill plate to be now. It's gonna have to yolo it like this. Yeah, I can't get a good view guys. But yeah, it's a big mama man. It's so big I can't even hold them. It's heavy dude. I can't get a good hook, so I mean, I can't hold him correctly. You need to release him. No, don't do that to my shmah. No. Get him in that move. Oh. Oh, Alright, get out of here, man. That thing will make it. Carp are strong, dude. Holy crud. Damn, that was like 25 pound carp, dude. Look at that. Now that that, now that I call a carp, that seagull is here. I know what it wants. 
see this see the seagull it wants my minnows uh, i don't feel like getting attacked by a bird though i wish i had something to throw at it hey, you're stupid birdie get out of here get out of here i really wish i had something to throw at it well it looks like we just have to rig up another my our drop shot another time Will just caught a PB carp today. Couldn't even hold him. No, stop calling your friends, boy. We ain't gonna get no food. No, it's gaining confidence. Better not be a sick one or something. Nope. Nope. We ain't gonna get nothing, boy. As soon as I get my line untangled, you done, so. Nope. Ah, oh, dang it. Just trying to walk up closer. Now you ain't gonna get no food, boy. Ah, stupid bird. Bugging me. He's walking closer to me. I don't want nothing to do with you, boy. I mean, if you're gonna walk along the edge, go ahead. I don't care, but better not go for my bucket or attack me, boy. This is why I hate seagulls. <laughs> Oh, he's calling his friends over there. It's good! Get the ass over here! Explosion. Jet Fest 2003. Yes, sir. Shh. Shh. We're gonna plan it out. We're gonna plan it out. We're gonna work. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah.